Tonight we're talking about a really interesting thing about perfume. Is your perfume aging your skin? Yes it is. <laughs> well, we're going to find out why. So when we're getting ready we know it's coming into summer even in Scotland and what's happening is we want to look good so we're getting the hair all highlighted or whatever we're getting the new clothes on the summery clothes and before we go out what do we do we get that perfume and we liberally spray on all over <gasps> and that's where the clue is right we're spraying our favorite scent all over not realizing that when you spray it directly onto the skin the damage and the havoc it's causing to your gorgeous skin <laughs> so why is that happening right so think about the perfume or aftershave i hope some of the guys can hear this as well or tell your tell the men in your life girls so even aftershave has the same effect it cause it's because it has alcohol in it right so when you spray alcohol onto the neck here and onto the decollete when you spray it onto this area liberally and you go outside into the sun here is the thing the sun is going to render your skin photosensitive the the alcohol in the product makes your skin more prone to lines wrinkles sunburn okay and premature aging and even skin cancer by just liberally spraying it directly onto the skin so how we see this when you're doing facials or you see clients or you'll notice it now because I've I'm telling you about it. When you see someone has done this and damaged their skin, you'll see mottled marks on their neck at either side because they went skush, skush, or they've sprayed it here and you'll see a mottled effect of pigmentation around this area, even broken capillaries. Really not good. And it's because of the alcohol. So, you know, when you're at that duty free and you go through the airport and, you know, they're always wanting to sell you a perfume or aftershave maybe a good question to ask is have you got an alcohol free one and that's the one to think about alcohol free because alcohol spread directly onto the skin is going to cause all these pigmentations and make your skin much older looking and in some cases much worse than that so one of the things that you see around this area it's um, a horrible skin condition called polkaderma of Savat and what is actually happening here is that the same thing is occurring it's damaged the skin so much that you see the skin starting to go different patches of white and brown um, and broken capillaries all over and this is when you have that condition here it's because it's not being protected enough that skin so how do you protect this area you know I'm always talking about this when you're really looking after your skin and you you may be and I hope you are that JL person where you're doing all your skin regime your anti-aging skincare at night I want you to always think that you have to treat your skin from the chest area up you've really got to think that and when you go outside you should be covering and thinking about how am I going to protect the area that's exposed to the elements to the sun especially just now so protecting this whole area is really really key so not just from the face and you've got to think about from right down from here upwards so say you have got this pigmentation right here right now what can you do about it so I would always say first step is to try and see a jail um, girl out there who's trained, an esthetician who's trained in skincare to this advanced skincare level. I would try to do that. Um, what you can think about is when you're using serums and stuff is to look at antioxidants under your moisturizer. So cleanse the skin and apply an antioxidant serum next and then apply a moisturizer and always last of all you're looking at a sunscreen right down to this area okay the whole area and the sunscreen you're looking at should be broad spectrum you've heard of this broad spectrum hi Victoria how's Brody dying to see both of you so let's go back again to 
what you're looking at the broad spectrum you're looking at uv areas now the uv areas when they reach the skin that's the ones that penetrate damage your collagen and age the skin and the uvb ones are the rays that don't penetrate as deep but they burn the skin they give you sunburn cause sunburn so you really want to be looking for the term broad spectrum on any sunscreens and then you know you've got them all covered okay so antioxidant serums your moisturizers and your sunscreens and top really from here upwards good ideas to think about is we have a gel cleanser which has got um, glycolic acid and a glycolic acid cleanser is really good if you've got the pigmentation because it's going to help fade the pigmentation so think about cleansers with glycolic acid that's going to help throw off the dead skin speed up the skin cell renewal um, retinol you've got to be careful with retinol you can still use it but at night but I would be very careful if you're using retinol you must be very careful using it and less is more and also ensuring that you put sunscreen on during the daytime if you're using a retinal product. Um, I think that you can go and have facials with light therapy that's going to lighten and brighten the skin. That's a great idea to do that. If you follow all these steps, and the most important thing is protecting your skin when you go outside to stop it happening again to prevent the age spots. So where do you spray the perfume okay so where do you spray the perfume to be safe i think really for me the only safe way to spray perfume is to spray it in the air in front and walk through it okay spray in front of you and walk through the mist i don't think you should spray it on your hair either because especially if you've got colored hair it's going to damage your hair again so don't spray it on the hair I think that okay to put some on the wrists you don't need to rub them together but spraying on your wrists or even the inside of the forearm these are not exposed to the sun usually and that's why i'm suggesting these things okay so be safe keep that skin looking good keep that skin looking gorgeous and healthy remember if you have any skin problems you can email me at joan at gl formulations and i can absolutely throw you to the well throw you I can show you directly to the nearest JL salon and nice to see you Aisha I hope that you are going to protect your skin have a great week enjoy what good weather we're hoping to get bye for now bye